So you might have heard of dedicated hosting and VPS hosting. Uh, here's the quick and dirty, the article below goes into a ton of detail to help me make an informed decision, but this is what you need to know. Basically, dedicated, a dedicated server is like owning your own computer. You have a big box, and that sits in a storage place, it has tons of redundancy, and it's pretty much, uh, there's good dedicated servers, like there's low end, which can be not so good, then there's really high end stuff, which you're gonna pay out the nose for. VPS is actually, you've probably heard of the cloud, that's what they're referring to, it's actually uh, cloud computing, and it's uh, distributed over several different computers, if not hundreds. And basically this is a scalable solution. So if you're a small business or a, a mid-sized blogger and you're looking to like speed up your site a little or you need more computing power or you're running some really intensive scripts, you know, shared, or I mean, shared hosting is not gonna work for you. VPS hosting will and it doesn't always come at the price dedicated. Sometimes even the top of the line is more expensive than dedicated. But the big thing you need to know about VPS is it allows you flexibility to upgrade, downgrade based on your current needs. A dedicated server will cost you a lot more money, but you have all the resources to yourself. If you want to know more information, read the article below. Enjoy. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments.